All right, guys, what's going on? Your boy David Exclusive, aka DaveX, aka David. It's just David. Y'all can just call me David, even though we did the name change. But welcome, guys. Welcome to a new Bleach Brave Souls video. Uh, at this very point, it is uh, ten thirty in the morning. I got like ten minutes left before I got to work, so I'll just record this really quickly, and I'll probably do the edit and upload later today after work. But uh, we got the news that we got the end of the month banner prediction of the new characters. I already spoiled myself a little bit. I was scrolling through my uh, YouTube feed and we got another account for your own world round 10 with a new Tsukishima, a new Ginjo and Mayuri, Sunflower Mayuri apparently. So, and if I'm not mistaken, if I read it correctly, I'm not sure. This might be the final round of Comfy on World, I'm not sure. Uh, but we got the trailer, so I really, uh, especially just uh, took like quick 10 minutes, like, yo, let's record this real quickly. So, uh, before we go to work, so let's uh, hit the game, hit start, and let's do the upload. Uh, my apologies, I'm still, I'm barely awake, so <laughs> let's do this real quickly. My cat is like walking around here as well. Uh, if I got the possibility, I'll, okay, so music, the game volume. Okay, let's go. Here goes. I the boy Ginja, let's go. Tsukishima's artwork actually looks dope. Hey, the boy, really? He looks nice. He looks dope. Hey, let's go. I really like the artwork on these characters. Um, okay, it's a very short trailer, but uh. Look out for more details shortly. Well, I'm quite sure that we got some in-game news. Okay, so we got the boy Tsukishima, uh, Mayuri and Kugo. Uh, I really hope that uh, the boy Kinjo is finally better than uh, the ones that we already got in the in the past. Uh, <laughs> so let's go. Um, the artwork on these characters actually looks dope. Definitely Mayuri and Tsukishima, I really like their artwork. I don't know what happens with Ginjo. I mean, we just saw his hollow state. Does that mean that we're gonna get a transformation mechanic? I don't, I do not know. Four different summons, obviously the total banner and the individual ones. Tsukishima is gonna be speed. Apparently, he is going to be the Jugram counter for what I've read in the spoiler on YouTube. Uh, we got Ginjo, which would be the very first ranged character with guard break when it comes to power. And we got uh, Mayuri. So uh, Mayuri is going to be the first individual with uh, the Toshiro, the Izuru, the Tenzas and Getsu. <laughs> Fucking hell, Caleb. Why do you keep adding this character as a filler? Uh, Yumuchika. Uh, we got Ginjo with... <laughs> Ginjo with Makoto, <laughs> oh lord. Uh, we got Ukiora, which is a dope ass character. Uh, Hiyori, which is definitely not bad. And Speed Wenji, which is becoming uh, a way too common filler as well. Uh, we got Tsukishima with the final individual banner with... Uh, okay, this is decent. Ah, the Ikaku! <laughs> uh, we got the Amagai, uh, the new one, which is actually not bad. We got the Toshiro, which is really good. We got Lisa, which is really good. And Ikaku, which is, uh, yeah, it is what it is. Let's get into the news real quickly. I got like four more minutes left to uh, until I need to prepare myself. Um, so let's hurry up. <laughs> uh, character Tsukushima, melee normal attack type. All attacks except strong attack to have a chance to inflict a new drain status ailment. What does this mean, drain? Uh, strong attack to is a vortex on self. Plus boost. Okay, very interesting. 792 attack. Killer Stern Ritter. There we go. So uh, he's probably gonna be the Jugram counter. Uh, damage taken minus 16%. Weak in duration. Okay, okay, weak in duration. Uh, yes, obviously. Yeah, yeah. This is definitely gonna be the, the Jugram counter. Uh, long reach. Flurry, weak in defense. Nice. 
Uh, Sprinter plus one, Brave Battle, Temporary Invincibility. So he has actually the same inv inv blah blah, invincibility that Jugam has. Nevertheless, though, he has the killer, he has a weakened duration, he has the poise, the enhancer, the boost move, flurry, everything that you need to have for the Jugram counter. So yeah, not bad. I mean, if you want to survive in PvP, this character is definitely the one to go with. Um, this is actually really, really interesting for my main account because I do have a max transcendent Ichi Bay. So that would be a great link to add on him. I do have a five out of five uh, Sangetsu that I could work on. So this is really interesting. Uh, as long as he will probably survive until we'll get a a new counter for this Tsukishima uh, but fairly interesting uh, Tsukishima in PvP not bad uh, he has the no affiliation so that's already a hard killer to uh, to get so uh, okay really good really interesting definitely one of the best character up until now uh, we got Ginjo Kugo with 784 attack as well so he's a normal attack damage character new skill follow up what does this mean uh, a one card killer, uh, normal attack damage plus 25, okay, flurry and guard break, there you go, great skills. Uh, Bruiser, Berserker and weakened defense, uh, devastation, sprinter plus one and the follow up. So yeah, uh, definitely not a bad character since he has a very good uh, normal attack damage boost alongside with 784 attack which is amazingly good flurry i don't know what follow up means if someone could tell me that'd be nice he has guard break um so yeah uh amazing great character uh miyuri let's go range strong attack type all attacks have weaken okay special move automatic revival okay and the new skill increased speed droplet plus 17 percent um this is definitely going to be like something that will affect the new power up system in my opinion that we will be getting fairly soon i think though i'm not too sure on that so uh, 811 811 sp very nice a spot a killer um not a very good killer to have but apparently his gameplay uh and his kit is amazingly good so he's definitely going to be good when it comes to guild quest that's for sure strong attack recharge time minus 12 percent on a soul trade weakened duration as well minus 100 percent definitely very good uh he has guard break as well let's go a hey, uh bruiser berserker devastation sprinter speed droplet frenzy havoc and debilitator plus five seconds okay oh there there we go. I <laughs> okay. They they uh, new drain status ailments. Characters affected by drain suffer damage, and any attacks the character has that normally cause status ailments has zero chance to cause a status ailments while drain is in effect. Drain also heals the attacking character. <laughs> what? How OP can you have a status ailment be? Uh, so the character affected by drain suffers damage. Any attacks that the uh, the car with the status elements nullifies and the healing effects for the attacking character yo what that's op follow-up allows the character to cause damage to prone opponents okay well i don't even know what that means but uh, i guess we need to find out when it comes to that uh the filler pull oh confi own world hey okay this is nice uh so we got tsukishima we got ginjo we got miyuri we got uh retsu which is like a newer premium character we got kisuke and yorichi which are already Way too common fillers. Caleb really needs to step up their game when it comes to the fillers. We got Hikone, and we got Grimja, and we got Neliel. Okay, that's that's nice to see the comeback of these characters. Uh, personally, Hikone is still very good in my opinion. Grimja basically got the shaft a little bit, but in my opinion, he's my favorite Espada when it comes to the resurrection forms. Um, I really like his artwork and his gameplay, even though he's not that great, but I wouldn't mind getting copies of him. Neliel, definitely a great character as well. Poised, flowy, uh, moving vortex, weekend, very good character in the overall uh, stats and skills as well. We got White Ichigo, uh, Byakuya and Gin. So definitely not a bad character, uh, bad uh, 
bad banner to summon on uh yeah it's looking really good guys um i'm definitely gonna summon on this banner at least when it comes to this account on this account i do have uh almost 3000 orbs so um i'm leveling up a few characters as well so I don't know how many orbs I'll go in for, but uh, we'll definitely give it a shot. When it comes to my other account, as you guys have seen on my last video, we went completely down to zero on Shuhei. Definitely go check out the video because it's definitely worth it. But uh, yeah, I probably won't be able to summon on that account. I'm gonna try to farm some orbs, but uh, we'll see. So yeah, uh, your boy has exactly one minute to prepare yourself real quickly. So yeah, hope you guys all enjoyed the video. If you did, you know what to do. Hit the like button down below to show some love and support. Let me know into the comments down below guys uh, Who is your favorite character out of this banner? Are you guys gonna summon on this banner? If so, how many orbs will you guys be going in for? Are you guys gonna skip? Um, I don't think people are gonna skip that much because we got the Jugram counter which everyone basically wants to get The Miyuri looks good. The Ginjo actually looks good. So yeah, uh, let me know anything into the comments down below guys I'll always read them and I'll always uh, and I always will try to reply on every single one So don't hesitate comment down below follow Follow your boy David on his socials on Instagram and on Twitter guys please uh, furthermore if you're new don't hesitate hit the subscribe button down below all that good stuff to see more bleach based social related content and that's it for the video so your boy David is going to hurry up and go to work so yeah hope you guys all enjoyed the video <coughs> excuse me you all know what to do like comment share subscribe all that good stuff and hope to see you guys all again into the next upcoming videos on to the next one guys take care later peace